Don't mind me, I look so tired right now. I just got back from two weeks in Toronto. I literally got back like a few hours ago. I've just been resting, but I really need to get some cleaning done. I need to water all my plants. I need to unpack. Tomorrow I somehow have quite a busy day because I need to go to the pottery studio again. I should have booked it for a different weekend. Why did I? pack it in and then I also have Pilates class because I have to use all my credits. Anyways, so we're gonna get do a little unpacking. I think I'm gonna first water all my plants. It's been two weeks and I'm just happy there's not a lot of yellow leaves from what I see. Okay, let's get started. got too hungry so some food first also I am wearing shorts underneath the shirt I just realized I look kind of naked in some of the shots but they are shorts underneath my shirt FYI Morning guys, I had a really nice sleep. I was like knocked out. One of those sleeps where you wake up and you're like, did I just sleep? I have a bit of a busy day. I'm still doing the last bit of cleaning. I just washed all my bed sheets, put them to dry. 
Um, but now I have to go to my Pilates class and then I have to go to pottery after. I forget if I mentioned in a previous vlog that why I'm doing the pottery thing all of a sudden, or I think I did mention that like I was making it for uh, Nate's parents as like a gift to like bring back when I went out to Canada, but in the end it wasn't ready in time. So anyways, I rescheduled a session that I booked um, for today just to do the glazing and I guess I'll just have it for myself. Um, anyways, I'm gonna finish up breakfast quickly and then we can head out. to pottery now i'm just gonna walk there because it's like a 27 minute walk but um 21 minutes by the bus so might as well <laughs> early to my class so i'm at a little park right now eating the sandwich i just bought i was getting hungry and i saw this like cute deli so i thought i would try something at first I was like not really into it because it was like cold but then after I got past the coldness I was like oh it's actually a pretty good sandwich the red onion chutney in it really saved it like the sweetness with the mustard is very good to meet a friend we're going to um, a pottery second sale of these like ceramicists I've been following for a while so I'm kind of excited to see what they have normally it's like quite expensive so this should be good um, not that I need any more pottery I've been having a string of really bad luck recently just one thing after another and I'm hoping this is the tail end of it because yeah, I'm just so tired. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you've probably seen a lot of it, but I broke my hard drive recently, so two videos gone like that. Well, one of them I think I can save, but I'm not sure. And then um, I went to Ibiza, which was like the worst trip ever. But I had flights canceled, both of them going and coming back. I was caught up in the air, tra air traffic thing, but going there was canceled. And honestly, I should have taken it as a sign from the universe to not go on this trip because every single day something bad happened. Luggage was lost or like it was so difficult trying to get where we're trying to go or the, like everything was like so crowded. Um, I think the only shining light is that somehow the, our, the group of friends I went with, we didn't like argue or anything. Like it was still good. We were kind of just laughing through the pain. Um, so that was good. But other than that, it was kind of a shit show to be honest. And even on the way back, there was no flights. Like I'm sure you guys have seen on the news how difficult it is. It was during the air traffic control glitch. But we basically had to figure out our own route because we were like, we are not staying in a visa for another night. Um, well, we had to stay one night, but we're like, the next flight out was like Friday and it was like Monday. So we ended up finding our own flight to Belfast and then booking a separate flight, like not even a connection to um, London. So anyways, I'm getting to the sale now. So let's go look at some pottery and decompress.
ones. Oh my god, can you even oh, little pigs. <laughs> Hello, buddy. Hi, buddy. Wow, it's a full on farm here. Goats? This is actually the one, the reason why I wanted to go. But it's like very cute, right? It's 15 pounds. I think normally they're like 35. Um, and then cut a little. It's like a little sauce pouring. I thought it was quite cute. But it's like oh. the shape. <laughs> and then a very different one. Oh, this cup I didn't nice. have a mug, so this one was more expensive. It was 18, but I think it's this quite nice. This cup is pretty nice. Yeah. I actually don't have any cups with handles, so mm. yeah. And lastly, I got two little bowls because I couldn't find big bowls, but these are quite cute, right? Quite cute, yeah. They're by Laura HWWS. I think they're 10 or 14, 12, 12 each, so not bad. just a PSA that COVID is still here and still feels like shit. <laughs> <coughs> so I seem to have caught the new variant that's like going around. It seems more contagious than before. I think this is my second... I think this is only my second time getting COVID, but this time definitely is the worst. Like, the other time, sick for a day, maybe chills for one night. Uh, I was, like, done. But this time, the throat is super itchy, and, like, I was so tired yesterday. I slept, like, the whole, like, not the whole day, but, like, I kept needing to sleep, like, every few hours. Oh, anyways, I'm feeling better today, but still not 100%. I can't stop coughing, so I'm gonna... <coughs> I took today off work as well, and yeah, I'm just gonna try and chill and feel better today, cause, yeah, I'm just gonna try to chill and hopefully feel much better. I Yeah. Uh -huh.